What 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 Water is not wet. Wet is a description. Okay, so water is wet. When you're referring to something being wet, you're talking about the water. I learned in Mr. Perez's physics class is that when it rains, when something gets wet, it's water. So it's definitely wet. Water is not wet. When you go out in the rain, you don't say the rain is wet. Your hair gets wet when you're in the rain. That's like saying, oh no, the ocean is getting wet. That's not, that doesn't make sense. Water is not wet. It has to be dry before it's wet. So water's not wet. Water is not wet. What happens to us when we come in contact with water is we get wet. That is our experience with water. We get wet. But water itself is not wet. Water is wet because when you touch something, you're wet. So water is wet. Water is not wet. Something can only become wet whenever it touches water. If it rains on a lake, you're gonna say the lake is wet. That makes no sense. And I'm done. Why are you looking at me? <laughs> water is wet. Telling me that a fish is not wet in water until it's out of water is the stupidest thing I have ever heard. <laughs> At Franco Donadelli. No bro, did you not see the video? He described it perfectly. Water's not wet if you put the water into a puddle. You didn't make the puddle wetter, you just added more water to it. No, really? No way. It's like saying we're dry until we get wet. Leave it at that. <laughs> it's true though. That's true. So what is this for? Is water wet? Is water... I, I don't have no idea what what's the point. I have like... <laughs> no, it's, not, it's not funny. I don't think it's funny. I have, I have a job to keep up with. I have like 160 students. I've got student loans that I have to pay off, designing lessons, for ch and you're gonna, you, you, you're gonna use my valuable time to ask me if water is wet. I'm, I'm out. Bye. Can't take it. I'm sick of it.